welcome to lovely nail and beauty please subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell also don't forget to click on the like button if you like the video thank you hi guys welcome to lovely nail and beauty resign today i have a new project i'm gonna teach you how to create coaster with a resign so the video title today is gonna be the coaster made with a resign so right there i have my silicone mold beaker and i have my resign so i'm gonna pour i'm gonna prepare a big quantity of resign so i'm gonna pour 50 milliliter of resign and while i'm pouring my resign i watch the graduation also so the project today is gonna be a new project and now i'm gonna use the other resign but it's gonna be the harder resign i'm gonna show you it's over there and it's a lot harder so i'm gonna add 50 milliliter inside and the both quantity should be equal so all together i will have a hundred milliliter of resign that's a big quantity for my project so I don't need to prepare the resign each time I have that already. So now I'm going to use my hood stick and I'm going to mix my resign because the quantity is big. It can take me two to three minutes. I really take my time to mix my resign and you can see how it's getting cloudy with some bubble. That's mean that there is a reaction. So now my resign is ready. So now I'm going to show you first what I'm using. That's the coaster that I'm using for my project. I'm going to use four. So that's one of them. And I have another one who have a wall in the middle. So that's what I'm going to use. So now I'm going to prepare. That's my first coaster. I have my silver stone over there. So I'm going to put in the small container and I'm going to add a small quantity of resin. So now I'm going to mix that together. I want that to be a little bit thick and you're going to see why. So I'm preparing a big quantity of clear resign on the side so that I don't have to prepare the resign each time that I'm going. So now I'm going to put that in the middle and I'm going to try to create a circle with those stones. They are shiny and bright and I like them. Again, the project today, I did a similar video also, so you can go on my channel, Lovely Nail and Beauty, and you can check that video too, and the coaster comes so good. So that's my first coaster. Now I'm going to leave it on the side for a couple of minutes, and uh, I'm going to bring another coaster one. And I always like to use a flat surface and the plastic one so that if there is an extra of resin that fall, it will not stick. So now I'm gonna use the gold, the gold stone that I have. I like them, they're very sparkle. It's very shiny and the color are nice. And I'm gonna add a small quantity of resin inside. So I'm gonna mix them together. There we go. It's a little bit thick. I don't want that to water it. Okay, so I'm going to mix that again. So I'm going to create again like the previous one, a circle in the middle of my coaster. That's going to be the second coaster that I'm going to create. I try to create a circle in the middle. So it's going to be very bright. So that's the second one. And I'm going to leave that on the side also for a couple of hours while I'm preparing all the resign that i need i mean a couple of minutes so i'm gonna put it on the side and i'm gonna start to prepare my resign different color that i'm gonna use for my project so i'm gonna use also different cup i have some plastic cup over there i use them or sometimes the silicone one and i'm gonna pour the resign in small quantity and it's so amazing when you're working with uh, a container that have a big resign you find yourself just walking through without each time making again the resign so i'm gonna put the resign in each cup in small quantity because i would like to create different color and also i would like to thanks my viewer and subscriber even those who watch my video and does not subscribe i really appreciate you for your time and the project of today, the title is a coaster made with resign. That's what I'm going to teach you today. So now I have my resign in my small cups. 
now i'm gonna use some glitter powder right there i have uh, the green i like the way it look and now i'm gonna pour the pink so i choose those color randomly i like to choose the sparkle color and it's very colorful too that's the orange it looks so nice so and over there i'm gonna use the purple so that's the glitter powder that i'm gonna use for my project and i'm gonna put that on the side so i'm just preparing all the resign that i need for my project and now i have the white uh, metallic acrylia acry artesia i'm sorry acrylic painting i'm using that too for my project so now i'm gonna use my hood stick i'm gonna mix everything and i speed up the video a little bit so each time i'm gonna clean my hood stick with a paper towel that i have on the side because i don't want to use more material that i should not so i'm preparing the white so those color i'm preparing the resign for my coaster i like to do that ahead so that when i start pouring the resign everything come together and i'm gonna add a little bit more glitter powder I really like the way that it looks. It looks so nice, sparkle. Again, if you want to see more artwork that I have realized so far, you can go on Lovely Nail and Beauty on my channel. My channel is based on beauty art decoration creation nail. So there is a different kind of project that I have done so far. And hopefully you can find a project that you like. Or even if you find a project that you don't like, feel free to write me. I will be so glad to hear from you and learn from you too. So on my channel, I'm doing painting, how to create soap, candle, uh, what else, project with resign, nail. So I'm doing like almost anything, <laughs> everything. So you can go over there and check my channel and see if there is something that you like. So on my resign, I add more powder because I really want the color to show more. That's why I'm adding and you can see it's bright and it just look cute. I love the way it look. They are bright color. And the glitter pow a powder always bring a sparkle look on my project. So now I'm going to put it on the side. There we go. And now uh, I'm going to bring back my first coaster the one with the silver stone in the middle so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna create again another resign over there with that big cup i'm gonna put the yellow metallic artesia acrylic painting that's the brand that i'm using for my project i like it and i'm gonna pour my resign inside there we go. I would like to create another color. I don't want all the resign to be glitter powder. So this is the yellow one. They look nice. I like the metallic color. They are very shiny. So now I'm going to start pouring my resign. So I'm going to pour them in circle one after the other one. Because I would like to create different layer of color. And you're going to see how it's going to look at the end. So I just pour them randomly, different layer in circle emotion. And I have this great feeling that the project is going to be amazing and look beautiful. So we're going to see at the end how it's going to look. But I feel pretty confident about that. So I'm pouring the resign one after the other one in the circle emotion. But so far, so good. I like what I see. The colors are bright, nice, and cute. And some of those resign, I'm going to use that for my next project too. For the next coaster. So because this is the first one, I don't like to spoil the resign. So whatever left over, I will try to create something new with. I like that coaster look nice to me already. The colors are bright. They are beautiful. But my silicone mold is not full completely. So I'm just keep adding the resign around. So now I'm going to add the clear one. Because I will like that coaster to be translucent a little bit as you can see. What is doing to the resign that I have the painting. It looks so amazing. I love that. That looks so nice. So I just make sure that my mold is full 
with the resign okay so now i'm gonna leave it on the side for 24 hours after that we're gonna come back and now i'm gonna start doing the second coaster so that's the first one so now this is the second coaster that i have now with that resign i'm gonna add more clear resign and i'm gonna try to create a new color so i'm gonna use that uh metallic green i like the way it look it look nice it's almost nothing in the bottle so i'm gonna create a new color and i have some resign that i create on the side already so i'm gonna mix everything it looks so nice i like the way the color look it's very nice so that's gonna be my second coaster that i'm gonna create the video today is gonna be a little bit longer but it's worth it the end so now i'm gonna pour again my resign randomly one after the other one in circular emotion so i'm gonna create other color so the first one it was more yellow pink and red but this one is gonna be more blue purple okay so i'm keep pouring my resin it looks so cute already i like what i'm seeing i choose a nice color and you're gonna see the beauty of those coasters at the end with the the glitter powder i really like to use it so i keep pouring my resin so far so good i really like the way it look it look amazing and at the end we're gonna see how it's gonna look so I'm, I'm, I'm keeping adding the layer of resin because I have to make sure that the silicone mold is full. Okay, I'm gonna add again. It looks so nice. I like the color that I choose. They are nice color. And I hope that you guys, you're gonna like the project too. Again, if you wanna see another video that I made about the coaster, and they look so beautiful also on my channel so this is going to be my second video how to realize a coaster before resign and they have a different style so you can go back and check the other video so that's a new style that i'm doing for those coaster but so far so good i like the way it look it look very nice and i have this great feeling that it's gonna come out so good so now i'm gonna leave it on the side on flat surface for 24 hours after 24 hours no now i'm gonna prepare again a resign i'm gonna pour that in the small cup i would like to create new resign color for the third coaster because i'm doing four so the two first one i create already the color so i'm gonna create new color for this one so I want you to be there with me. As you can see, I prepare already the resign, the clear one on the side. So I'm gonna add the pink metallic artesia acrylic painting. And here I have the purple. So it's almost empty. I really need to shake it so that it come. Okay, look nice. And here I have the blue, the metallic blue acrylic artesia. It's kind of indigo it look nice okay that look good and still i'm gonna do again the white metallic artesia acrylic so i just put a small quantity of resin because the resin is it's a small quantity of resin that's why i didn't put a lot of painting because if i put more painting than resin the project is gonna be sticky so that's the pink one it look nice already i love it and now i'm gonna do the blue one the metallic blue all those colors they look so nice so with this third coaster i'm gonna do another design so there is different way to do different design with the resign project it's up to your imagination so now i have an idea about this third one and i like the color that i choose they are very pretty so we're gonna see again i know that the video is long but the end is really worthy and i would like to share with you all the job that i'm doing so that maybe you can try that or learn something new so now i'm gonna mix the white acrylic artesia with the resign i like the effect that it have on the other resign so now my color are ready 
I love them. I'm going to create another one over there. Okay. So for this one, I'm going to use the clear, the clear stone. They are very shiny and they are translucent, but I love them. It's very sparkle. And I'm going to put uh, some clear resin in small quantity inside. So I'm going to mix them together. So I'm going to use the stone to realize the third coaster. And I'm going to use the mold that I have the hole in the middle. So there is different kind of mold that you can use for your coaster. That's the other one. So I'm going to put those stone in the middle around the hole. And I like the way it look. Again, I put a small quantity of resin because I don't want, I want the stone to stick together. I did that in purpose. So it looks so nice. So I just try to fix those stone around. Okay. All right. So I have that. And after I finish to fix them, I'm going to start pouring my resin, my color resin that I prepared already. But I really like the way that the stone look. It's very shiny. It have like a diamond look. It's very nice. So now I'm going to try to pour my resin. Again, I'm, I'm going to do like the two previous ones. I'm going to pour them in circular emotion one after the other one. But with this coaster, I'm, I will create another design. And we're going to see. So I like the color that I choose. They are very beautiful. They're nice and very bright. So I'm going to pour them one after the other one. It looks so nice. Okay, so I'm going to add the blue now around. They really look nice. I like the way it looks. I like the color that I choose. Okay, I'm going to put white now so i'm gonna do that until i fill up my silicone mold that's the goal so i'm gonna add something i keep adding the layer okay and i'm gonna add also some clear acrylic in the middle because i still want the stone to show and you can see that the resin that i have the color try to hide the beauty of the stone so I'm putting the clear one in the middle so that I can still see the stone. Okay, so now I'm done with that. I'm going to add more resin. Make sure that the mold is full. And now I'm going to do what I'm going to do next. I'm going to use a toothpick and I'm going to create some pattern. I would like to create different patterns. So each time that I'm using my toothpick, I clean up with my paper towel on the side and again i speed up the video a little bit but i would like to create a different design for this one and i like the way it look it look nice stylish bright the color are so nice so now i finish one pattern now i'm gonna do the second pattern okay i bring back in the opposite direction the resign and you see how it look. It look cute, funny, amazing. And when you try to create pattern with the resign, sometimes the pattern can change after the resign. It's, it's uh, hard. It can change because it's a liquid. But you're going to still see some pattern. Okay, so now I'm going to leave that for 24 hours on the flat surface. And now I'm going to go do the fourth coaster. So I just want to make sure that the resin is fill up the mold. Okay, so now I'm going to create the last coaster. As you can see, I have those three colors. What I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new color. So I'm going to add the blue on the purple one because I don't want to waste any product. That's the goal. And here I have the black metallic artesia that I'm going to put on the blue. And I'm going to... I create again more white acrylic artesia resin and I'm gonna pour my resin inside in each cup that's what I'm doing so it's so easy because I prepare already my resin on the side so I don't have each time to create again the resin for each coaster so I'm pouring my resin in small quantity in each of them 
so that will be the last coaster again the video is long but the end is gonna be worthy so now I'm gonna use my hood stick and I'm gonna mix each container of resign and painting and I have this one too I'm gonna add the gold metallic artesia artesia acrylic painting so I'm gonna open up I'm gonna add a small quantity that will be the last color for this uh, coaster the fourth one and I'm gonna mix the resign with the painting there we go it looks so nice wow that's amazing I like the way it look I'm gonna add more resign so now I'm gonna create the last coaster for my project okay so when you have a big project it's always better to have a big quantity of clear resign on the side so that you don't have each time if it's finished to create again the clear resign it's made already is on the side and ready to be used for whatever design or color that you want to create so i mix each of my resign that's the one that have uh, the blue and the purple together and you can see how the color changed but at least i didn't waste nothing that's the beauty of it so the leftover make me realize a new color for the next coaster so now i'm gonna put that on the side and i'm gonna bring the last coaster finally <laughs> so i'm gonna pull my resign one after the other one not in the circular motion i'm just gonna pour them on the top of each other each time so i'm gonna play with the color so you can create any pattern any des design is up to you guys what you want to create so i just pour them one after the other one and with that coaster i will create another design that is so different that's what i'm gonna do so, okay put around okay so now i'm gonna keep adding the resign one after the other one so i like it because you can create any design you know what is cross your mind you can create whatever you want to create so for this one i will not put no clear resign i will just add my color until it's fill up the mold that's what i'm gonna do okay so far so good i like the way it look so for each of the coaster i let them on the flat surface for 24 hours so that it get hard ready after 24 hours we're gonna come back to see how it look i mean sometimes you can let it on the side for a couple of hours but i like to use the 24 hour time to make sure that the resign becomes so hard that the color set together okay so that's the last one so far so good i like what i see that's beautiful it's true that it's dark but i like it so now i'm gonna use my two picks so i'm gonna kind of create a flower over there and each time that I'm using my toothpick, as you can see, I clean up my toothpick with uh, my paper towel. So as you can see, the front is going to be the pattern will show more, but the back, maybe the pattern can be different. And we're going to see. So, so far, so good. It's true that it's dark, but it looks cute also. All right. So now I'm going to let it for 24 hours on the flat surface. And after 24 hours, we're going to come back to see how our coaster look. So now after the 24 hour, wow, that's amazing. That's the darkest one. So there is two side. You can choose, as I told you, the back side, I have another pattern. And the other side, I have another pattern. So you choose the one that you want to show but i like it it's very original it look nice it's so beautiful that's the first coaster so now i'm gonna take the second one wow this one it's so beautiful you see the stone and how the color look it's kind of translucent and you can see different layer it's so amazing that's amazing so you can choose the size that you want as front side 
that's so beautiful i love it oh my god i didn't know that it's gonna be like that so that's the other one over there with the pattern as you can see the pattern have changed a little bit but still you can see the stone and it look nice that's the back but i'm gonna use the other side where i see the stone that will be the back and that will be the front it look nice i love it and i can see the different color that's so amazing and that's the last one okay here oh my god the back it's amazing let's go let's see how it's gonna look so i'm gonna choose the side that show more color as the front side that's so amazing thank you so much guys for watching my video i hope that you learned something if you have any message don't forget to send it to me i really do appreciate the time that you have spent with me watching my video so this is my four flower coaster and it just came up so good it's amazing again if you want to see another video about coaster you can go on my channel lovely nail and beauty thank you so much guys i love you be safe bye don't forget to subscribe to my channel to click on the notification bell and the like button thank you for watching